So here in this video, we'll see a problem on projection of lines inclined to both the planes. For that, here is the question. The front view of line AB measures 50 mm and makes an angle of 45 degree with XY line. The point A is 10 mm above HP and 20 mm in front of VP. Draw the projections of the line AB if it is inclined with VP at 45 degree. So here I'll write the data first. The front view of line AB measures 50 mm. So that is the length of front view is given which is called as elevation length. And makes an angle of 45 degree with XY line. So the front view is making an angle of 45 degree that is denoted as alpha with XY line. So it will be seen in VP. Next, the point A is 10 mm above HP. and 20 mm in front of VP. Draw the projections of line AB if it is inclined with VP at 45 degree. Now inclination with VP will be seen in HP and it is given only of line AB, not the top view of the line. So it means this is the true length. So inclination of the true length with VP is denoted as phi. So these are the five parameters which are given in the problem and for solving any problems related to projection of lines inclined to both the planes we would be requiring five parameters. Now in this question all the parameters are there. So I'll start with the solution part. At first Point A is given, I will locate it. Ten mm above HP, twenty mm in front of VP. A dash and point A. Then the inclination of the elevation length is given that is 45 degree it will be seen in the front view. Measuring 45 degree. This angle will be called as alpha. Now over that I'll mark 50 mm length. Keeping it on A dash, cutting this line which is inclined at an angle. This gives me the location of B dash. Then through B dash I'm going to draw the light horizontal line. This will be called as locus of point B dash. Next, your angle phi is given 45 degree. That is the inclination of the line AB. With VP, it will be seen in HP. So, for that, here I am drawing light horizontal line parallel to XY through point A. Measuring 45 degree. Now, here in this problem, the true length of the line is not given. If the true length would have been given, then I would have taken that distance. Keeping it on point A, I would have marked on this inclined line. 
but since the true length is not given here we need to get the true length and for that the procedure is first i'll make a dash b dash which is inclined in the front view parallel with x y this will be point b2 dash and then projecting it like with the help of vertical line in the top view now where it is cutting this inclined line it gives me the point b2 This will be called as locus of point B. Then here the line which I am getting that is the true length. Next through B dash I will project a light vertical line downwards because where the front view of the line is ending within that same distance the top view should also end that is the distance between the end projectors are common so here it is cutting the locus of point b at this location i'll say this is point b so joining a to b will give me the length of the line which is the actual length in the top view next in a similar manner what I'll do here is measure the true length A up till B2 and directly keeping it on A dash I'm going to cut this locus. Another method is you can make AB parallel to XY and project it vertically upwards. That will also give you the same point. So here this will be called as B1 dash. then i'll make the lines dark starting with the actual length a dash b dash and a b next a dash b1 dash and a b2 after this i'll say that this is the tl the true length of the line here is elevation length the line in the front view which is 50 mm long this is tl and here is pl then the angle made by TL with HP or we can say XY line so here after this the angle made by the true length in the front view this angle would be called as theta the inclination of the line comes out to be 30 degree so i'll mention this the inclination of the line with hp is theta is equal to 30 degree answer one next the true length of the line 70 mm and with this the problem is completed